Hello and welcome to the Beer Search Party. This is Sean Inman and our final Oregon beer for the month of March is from Hopworks Urban Brewery, otherwise known as Hub. It is their Noggin Floggin Barley Wine Ale. And as you can see, it's got a very distinctive uh, bottle painting on it. It's not uh, one of those uh, normal labels. It is painted on the bottle, a la Rogue style. And this is a winter warmer from them, all organic and carbon neutral as well. And as we can see from here, if we turn this around a little bit, 11% um, alcohol, 24 degrees Play-Doh, and 70 IBUs. Uh, now the Play-Doh doesn't really measure into it for me, but the IBUs tell me a lot. And so does that alcohol by volume of 11%. So, let's check out this 2011 Winter Warmer from Hub. As you can see, it's a pretty uh, light color. Um, little orange, little yellow, sort of got a iced tea, lemonade sort of color going on to it. Nice uh, little tiny head going on there. Uh, Whitish. Now let's uh, get some aroma on the Hub Noggin Floggin Barley Wine. Uh, a lot of hops, uh, a little citrus, a little piney, um, quite, uh, it's sort of got a IPA pale ale sort of smell to it. So let's uh, take a taste. Wow, that is uh, a lot of caramel, um, uh, citrus. Um, you taste that alcohol, but the caramel is the first thing that uh, you get. You sort of think, okay, you, you slide into it, and it's pale ale IPA, and then all of a sudden you get this big burst of caramel, and uh, the, the alcohol comes through. I mean, this is very different from what I've uh, tasted before. I mean, some barley wines taste really strong. Some Imperial IPAs taste really strong, especially some that I've had lately. Um, but this sort of light that sort of slides through on that sort of caramel taste, uh, this would be great, I would say, in a float. It's, you'd get a nice vanilla ice cream maybe, something simple. I wouldn't get too fancy with like a fruit or a chocolate or a coffee, but a nice vanilla ice cream with this, that caramel taste would really take it someplace. And that the ice cream would also sort of cut on the alcohol taste for some people. Yeah, that is that is a good combo of the citrus and the caramel. I mean, that just really works well together. And when I was last up in Portland, when I got this bottle, I was able to visit their bike bar on uh, Williams, Northeast Williams. And I gotta say, I like what they do with their places. The uh, the bottle display on the back wall was tremendous, and I'm pretty sure it took a lot of time to get it all straight and pick which bottles to make it look good. And the fact that they were playing uh, uh, English Premier League soccer on a Monday afternoon was tremendous as well. Uh, so I I've had. Mostly great experiences with uh, Hopworks beer. Um, their survival seven grain stout is tremendous. This noggin floggin is is really good. So if you get up to Portland, I would suggest going to the original Hopworks Urban Brewery uh, or the Bike Bar. Either one doesn't matter, and uh, check out some of their beers. I had their. Uh, alt, their secret alt, and that was uh, quite tasty as well, and it had uh, some flavors that were very reminiscent of this barley wine here. Um, and for a last little treat before we go, as you can see, maybe it's got a dial, turn it up to 11. Clever, clever. Alright, thanks for watching. This is Sean Inman and the Beer Search Party. www.beersearchparty for other Los Angeles beer news or just whatever I think is cool in the beer world. Thanks for watching and cheers.